A new Wordle puzzle is online. Click on the link to play. Listening to the following video may give you clues. Please like and share the videos. Homes Under the Hammer's Martin Roberts has emergency heart surgery. The star of BBC's Homes Under the Hammer, Martin Roberts, has undergone emergency heart surgery. After experiencing severe chest pains in the middle of an adventure in the sun, he was rushed to hospital and giving only hours to live. Thankfully, the book's popular show has been running for the last six seasons. Martin was previously a campmate on I'm a Celebrity. Martin Roberts has emergency heart surgery. After a recent hospital scare, British TV presenter Martin Roberts has spoken of his emergency heart surgery. The star has revealed that he felt ill and was giving just hours to live. Emergency heart surgery saved his life, and he thanked the angel that helped him survive. But it's still unclear what exactly went wrong. He has opened up about the traumatic ordeal and is grateful to God and his doctors for saving him following the surgery. The TV presenter shared the news with fans on Twitter. Roberts told fans that he only had a few hours to live, and his condition was serious enough that he was rushed to the hospital. He told fans that he was super scared, but that the NHS was amazing. He was rushed to hospital with chest pains. The co-host of popular BBC show Homes Under the Hammer has revealed that he was rushed to hospital with heart problems on Wednesday. He told fans he was feeling unwell and was told he only had a few hours to live. The presenter has undergone emergency surgery and was told he had only hours to live. He thanked God and angels for saving him. Morton Roberts, 51, was born on July 20 in Warrington and later studied at Bradford University. He became a DJ at the university radio station before joining BBC Radio Manchester. He has always been interested in homes, so it was natural for him to become a TV host. He landed his first TV gig in 1998 as a regular co-host of the show Wish You Were Here, alongside television icon Judith Chalmers. Martin drove 26 hours to help refugees from Ukraine. He has sun-soaked explorations. Television presenter Martin Roberts is recovering after having emergency heart surgery, according to reports. The presenter, who is recovering at a hospital in Bath, revealed the news of his health problems on Twitter. Roberts said he felt unwell and went to the doctor, who diagnosed him with fluid around his heart. The emergency procedure saved his life, as doctors had estimated he had only hours to live. He is delivering supplies amid conflict with Russia. In the face of a terrible humanitarian situation in Ukraine, TV presenter Martin Roberts is offering his help to the country's displaced people. He has driven more than 1270 miles over 26 hours to bring aid to the war-torn country. Roberts has met with refugee families and filmed them distributing aid to their loved ones. He feels a sense of massive responsibility for helping the people affected by the conflict. The convoy had been due to enter Ukraine and deliver supplies to the front line, but the Russian forces were too close to make the trip possible. But, when asked why he was driving through France and Poland, a stranger bought two bottles of cold pull for Roberts and offered to drive the van. He told the camera crew he was nervous and knew the day would be hard, but was determined to make it. More than 2.6 million Ukrainians have fled their country to the EU since the 24th of February with 1.4 million of them now residing in other countries, including Hungary, Romania and Moldova. Help from Burnamouth is delivering supplies to these countries, as well as donations to aid agencies in the area. In the last three weeks, Russian military hostilities have surrounded entire cities and have used brutal siege warfare tactics. After he shared the video with his colleagues, Martin received a flood of well wishes. He also shared that he and Lucy Alexander were sending supplies to the Ukrainian border. The Russian invasion has led to unrest in neighboring Ukraine, with Russia shelling cities and the Ukrainian army vowing to fight to the death to protect their land. Observers fear that the death toll will be high.